And so many people are afraid to ring the ambulance and we found uh, every time we've rung them, they wouldn't take you if they didn't think you needed to go and they are so supportive. Um, they take all the worry of decision making away from you and, and that is much, much better. an aorta valve replacement, mm -hmm. and, which I'd known was coming for quite some time. Mm -hmm. However, the time came for it to happen and, and I arrived in here and I, due to unforeseen circumstances, um, I couldn't have it done at that time. So as I was leaving the hospital, my daughter was with me and uh, she said, oh, I think there's a bigger picture here, Mum, that we don't know anything about. And she said, somebody might need that operation more than you do at the moment. Within a fortnight, John uh, had been having angina attacks and went in to have an angiogram and finished up having a triple bypass. <laughs> and so about a fortnight after the time of my operation, he was in here with his triple bypass. So uh, we got him better. Um, and in the meantime, I'd come back about three times, um, once a month it seemed to me, until the January of, of 09 and uh, that was when my um, aorta valve was replaced eventually and I stayed here then and we've been very very well looked after and you've only got to look at us today to see we've been well looked after we're still here we are at Jesse McPherson Hospital today because it's heart week um, and people who've had open heart surgery can come back during this week and, and in enjoy the, the afternoon tea and a walk around the hospital and um, the, the fellowship of some of the staff that we met while we were in the hospital. And it's just lovely to see so many survivors. I would hope people would see um, the difference, looking after yourself, yes, and getting in touch with someone uh, in plenty of time. Don't, don't sit there waiting, waiting, waiting for something, an ambulance or something move very quickly when you've got a problem um, and, and look at the survivors and think, you know, we've got a good chance. If you have a heart attack, it's a warning um, and take it as such.